What's up guys, today we're at the park with the V-Car Racing 10th scale four-wheel drive short course truck to try the hill climb challenge. Hey everyone, I'm Nate. And I'm Abby. Amelia is hanging out with us. Popeye's at the house. No dogs allowed in the park today. We are the RC Sailors. Welcome to our RC family. We are here with this V-Car Racing 10th scale. It is truly 10th scale. Uh, ready to run four wheel drive awesome short course truck we did a speed test where this puppy was actually so fast that it literally wanted to fly a very fast rc truck now now i'm not saying this is cheap but for a really nice high quality brushless ready to run system this really is a good deal 240 dollars we'll have it linked in the description box below it's competing with some other big name brands out there like a Lexus. Flash, <laughs> uh, among others. Now, there are some other brands that like being named, like Arma, Arma Sinton. Now, I'm not saying this is better than the Arma Sinton. We love our Arma Sinton, but we need to find out if this will climb the hill or not. We also have a cool new ramp to debut. Can't wait to show you guys. My dad made it for the channel, so let's have some fun with this thing. This should be easy. I will say, I put a two cell lipo in there from Ovonic, it's a 5,000 milliamp two cell lipo. Um, I didn't want to hit everything with 3S power, so I'm just kind of cruising. I just want to see how it cruises up here. And at about a quarter of throttle, it did it just fine. Awesome. First try, nice and slow. Look at those tires. Don't they just look awesome? Yeah. yeah. I love the white lettering on the tires. Very cool. Let's hit it a little faster. Oh, even through the trees. The problems. <laughs> no problem at all. You want to give it a shot? Yes. Okay, Abby. I think you'll do this no problem. Oh, it is waterproof, by the way. And that was full throttle. Full throttle. Made it up the hill. Zero problems. And remember, this is only 2S power. This thing is fully capable of running 3S, which we did on our speed test. Then it was so fast. Oh, Abby, that's crazy. It was so fast that it lifted off the ground more than any other truck we've ever driven. Really, really fast. Look at that thing dominating the hill. Oh, <laughs> spoke way too soon. Abby's sitting in the mud, ready to have some fun. Woo! <laughs> you want to be the first to hit the ramp? Uh, I'll probably miss, so. No, it's a bigger ramp. Oh, what are you doing, Abby? Okay, go. Woo! Muddy, muddy, muddy. Muddy. Oh! Oh! You're not afraid of getting muddy and stuff, are you? I'm a big marshmallow, too. <laughs> hey, we've got, we've got company. We've got some company. Flat, get it. Okay, Marshmallow. Do it, Marshmallow. Do it. Let's go. <laughs> you, it almost says Marshmallow on your shirt. <laughs> okay, Abby. Let's debut the ramp. This is about one and a half times wider than the ramp that we've been using and definitely a little bit bigger. Check this out. This is the ramp that Dad made for the channel. Someone thought this was like diamonds or something or flags it's obviously a tire tread going up <laughs> with the anchors that's awesome right and then look the legs unfold <laughs> yeah that is gonna be fun come on come on no no officially missed officially missed come on abby you can do this Use the edge of the road as your guideline. You got like a couple inches away from the road. That's what I do. Oh, Abby. Oh, Abby. I gotta stay on street. Okay. This is embarrassing. How long have we had? I didn't think I was gonna even drive. Oh, Abby. Okay. Oh, okay. 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 On the wheels. Go again, girl. We probably should not be doing this on the asphalt. <laughs> Yeah, let's not do the asphalt. This thing can go in the grass. Let's move it. 
Oh yeah! Oh! <laughs> Nah. <laughs> I can bash, but I can't ramp. I'll admit it. I'm terrible at ramping. I will get better though. I will. Let's see if Nathan can not miss it on his first try. Notice he's lined up back there with it though. No! Oh, oh geez, why am I letting him drive this? I gotta turn up the back. At least I didn't do that. <laughs> yeah, the dual rates are so low. <laughs> excuses, excuses. He's saying, he's saying he didn't break something, but who says he did? Because I think he did. Well, let me show them. I just want to show everyone because it's fixable. <laughs> what? Okay, so it might be easier if I take the top off to show everybody. Body clips on the ramp. Maybe we'll maybe we'll do some Nate ramping uh, later. Because so if this happens to yours, it is very fixable. There's what? just a little linkage here. See, the wheel was loose, and I don't oh. want to lose a... I don't think there's a dog bone in there. Yeah, it connects right there. See, that's like a like a new kind of a dog bone. Anyway, it pushes, you just push down. should pop into place. I got pushed pretty hard. <laughs> Popped. Yep. And Ta we're back. Okay, good. Now this did, look at this, the ESC because of that crazy... Yeah, it's tape back in. Yeah, well, it's already, it's on there. But yeah, I probably put that back down a little better. We may not... I don't know if I want to ramp this too extreme today. We're not very good at ramping yet. I don't want to break it. We need to get better at ramping. I like this truck a lot. A We've lot, a lot. And I really don't want to break bending it. Bending so. back here where the body clips go. Since this is still in one piece, let's do our favorite spot, even though it's a little bit wet. And this truck is so cool. What we need to do, Abby, We've said it all the time. Every time we get a couple short course trucks that we like, we need to take them to the track in Lavalette and really put them through their paces because that's what these trucks deserve to do is drive on a RC. Oh, look at that. Look at that dirt plot I just hit. <laughs> ah, boom. <laughs> oh, why, why is this hobby so much fun? I, some people probably watch our videos and like cringe, but I don't care. I hit dirt clods with my trucks and roots. <laughs> Here we go. Yo. I want to hit that water so bad, but I'm gonna pass just because I really like this truck and I don't want to tear anything up permanently today. I already hit water. Yeah, but that's a lot more water. Oh, I rolled it. Oh, I want to hit this ramp a little bit more. <laughs> <laughs> I figured you did. <laughs> Look at that. Everything's a little bit wet. Remember, this is just two cell power right now. We uh, opted out of our three cell for the bashing. Let's do this. I'm just gonna hit it a little slower, see if I can get all four wheels on the ground. There we go, that was good. Just nice and slow, just juiced it right at the end. Oh, really? Oh. <laughs> what is that? <laughs> I need like a five foot wide ramp. <laughs> Uh-huh, uh-huh. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Oh, you need to get better at landing on its feet. Do we have, is there too much lip on the end of our ramp? I don't know. Is this truck too much of a beast? No, we're just not very good at ramping yeah, and true. like uh, compensating for which direction it's going. You're right. You know? You're right. Yeah, see, he went the wrong way. Went the wrong way. <laughs> we gotta remember this. We need to juice it for it to go back. Brakes, brakes, makes brakes it forward. forward. Juice makes it go back. Okay. And then here, let's try. Okay, kind of like let off the juice and then hit the juice again. Oh, I still didn't level it out. Let me so. try. Okay, got the marshmallow back at the controls. Yeah. I can't remember. That was just that was just pathetic in every sense of the word. That was as slow as it could be, and then it rolled three times, and then it was on its back. You need to do the marshmallow dance again. Ah. <laughs> Almost lost. 
a sacred body clip. I think we're, uh, been, I think we bent one. That body clip is taking a beating. I just told Abby that's it. I don't, how many people, give us a this comment. Is cramp practice, okay? <laughs> practice, just enjoy the ride. The, uh, how many people are still watching a giant marshmallow go two miles an hour and ending up like that every time? Are there people still watching this video? Oh. There it is. I think that counts. Yes. All the body clips are there. So you did it. <laughs> I think it was on its wheels. It counts. Go, go, go. There, you did it. So you triggered the juice and it stopped it from rolling over. Very nice. Good job, Marshmallow. Don't you dare break my truck. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, you're, you're doing it. This is how you learn, and you're learning with me. It and is. Nate. It's a new it's ramp. Practice too. Yeah. Oh, uh, I'll give that front bumper a lot of credit. It is really taking a beating. Yeah, that's a tough little truck. Uh, it's just hard. It's hard to remember what to do in the split second you have to decide what to do. See, I should have juiced it there. Let me give it a right? shot. Nate's but back at the controller. As I practice a couple more attempts here, I uh, just want to wrap the video up. I really like this truck, despite <laughs> what it, the brutal beating it's taking because of me. I do like this thing. This I can't might, believe it's still running. I think this is probably, let's put it this way. Of the off brand short horse trucks we've ever had. This has got to be my favorite. Uh, now name brand like Arma and stuff, I don't know. Oh, that was rough. I either need like a slightly bigger ramp or a slightly smaller ramp, I think. <laughs> no, you just gotta learn what to do. Yeah, hit it at the right speed and everything. Mm. Oh, at least you're off. landing on your feet. Well, after a roll then. Yeah, but it's so, oh, uh, yeah, it's but you can't turn. You're not very good at turning. <laughs> You think we would have? Well, that was painful. Poor thing. You think we've like never touched an RC truck before about how we're doing on this ramp? We just don't ramp like ever. No, and the only the ramp we've had is a small plastic, like kids ramp. Okay. Well, You're doing worse than me. <laughs> this is really fun. It's completely ready to run. It does come with a charger and stuff, which we left back at the house because I used my hobby grade charger to charge this up and the Avonic battery that's in there. Uh, by the way, I really like, I'm liking Avonic batteries a lot. We've been using them in a lot of different things. Planes, uh, my trucks now, and they're holding up really well. This runtime, it really will run for probably, in that truck, a lot of full throttle and stuff, maybe like an hour to an hour and a half or so. That's a lot of runtime for one battery. We'll have the batteries linked in the description box below. And then this truck is just a real winner. And if you missed, our speed test video, you should go watch that because on the three cell battery, it wants to fly, which is just so awesome for a truck at that like hobby grade and just level of quality brushless power and stuff for $240, significantly under $300. I like that a lot. Remember that's the battery charger and everything. So guys, all the links, all the good stuff will be in the description box below. Thanks a lot for watching. We'll see you in the next video. Bye.